Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Sprintz here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Thursday, January 28th, 2021. Free pick coming up in college basketball on this report. First, a quick note before I jump into everything. Uh, if you're hearing kind of a buzzy noise, we heard it on yesterday afternoon's video. Thought it was a battery going dead. It wasn't the case. So if you're hearing any kind of buzzy noise in the background of this video, just know that we're going to make sure we get that taken care of uh, on Friday afternoon. Going to be too tough to get to it on Thursday, but a potential need of a new microphone and we'll be able to get that on Friday hopefully. So apologize for any uh, any problems that you might be having audio wise, but we'll still give out the plays. We'll get to the plays quickly, hopefully now. Uh, but anyway, a free pick here on college basketball slate for Thursday. Don't forget to check out my NBA free pick video, which will be posted between 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. Eastern on Thursday. Got off to a nice start with our late release videos yesterday with the Sixers getting the cover, getting the outright win over the Lakers. So check for that on Thursday. Also, star the show for me on Thursday, a six star play in college basketball. Uh, we we won another seven star last night with Wisconsin and uh, this run continues over $6,100 of profit for $100 per unit betters since day one of this college basketball season and my plays rated five stars and higher those are now hitting 68% against the spread again going back to day one this college basketball season so check it out six star play college baskets star the show for me on Thursday while you're there I do have four NHL sides we're five and oh the last six cards in the NHL and those same same situations that work to go 5-0 and oh, come up with four sides on Thursday. You'll be able to get them all on my homepage at DocSports.com. Let's get to the free pick for Thursday in college baskets. I'm back in Arizona minus the points over Stanford. As I cut the video, they're about a 7, 7.5 point favorite. If you saw Stanford against UCLA last time out, you saw them win on the very final play of the game. An inbounds pass that was turned into a layup. Stanford wins by one. they got a lot of bodies that might be missing again in this game. And we know what happens and you know if you've been following me, I don't have a problem backing a team the first time they're missing a couple of bodies, but after that first game, it gets a little bit tougher for the team to pick up the slack. I think that's what's going to happen here. And of course, Arizona might not be completely healthy themselves. I'm looking at uh, the injury update on Matherin. He's listed as questionable, but the team is so darn deep in the backcourt, led by Akinjo. He's the leading scorer, averages five and a half assists per game. They've got Baker, second leading scorer. They've got another guard who averages a decent amount of assists per game. So they can overcome one guard missing a game. And in this first game without him, if he doesn't play, Play, they'll pick up the slack as far as I'm concerned. So I like Arizona minus the points, our free pick opinion for Thursday night's video. And again, don't forget, check out my Thursday afternoon late release NBA video, which I'll post between 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. Eastern on Thursday. And again, check out that six-star uh, play in college basketball on Thursday. Top play of the day, show uh, star of the show for me on Thursday's card. All right, let's put them in the win column. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Um...